Nice melody. Gör som vi, var glad och fri. Ja, ni kan inte låta bli med all energi. Hello, class. Hello, Mr. Anders. So, this is the first lesson, so we start with some basic Swedish, okay? In Sweden, we don't have the American easygoing, Hi, how are you? Hi, I'm fine, how are you? It stops already with the first, how are you? For the Swede, how are you is a real question that deserves a real answer. You will get a complete account of that person's mental state and health condition. We take that <laughs> as a real question. We do have a shorter ver version similar to yours, but it's a bit more complex. Hey, hur är det? Actually, it's, not pro it's more pronounced like, hey, hur är det? Hey, hur är det? Yeah. Fine in Swedish is bra, but you won't hear it this way. <laughs> in Sweden, we need to be modest, lagom. So we make it more lagom by putting ganska. Ganska. Ganska bra. Faktiskt. As if we are surprised, things can be quite fine, actually. My dad is really Swedish. Oh, everything's kind of okay, generally, on a very basic scale. My dad is a lot that way with things, and I, as Anders was talking, I was like, oh my gosh, my dad's totally Swedish. But this is still a bit too light-hearted for a Swede. <laughs> <laughs> Saying this, it's like bragging, showing off, quite good actually, haha, -ha, better than you. It's a bit like that. So we have to correct that by adding this little word here. We add a little no. How to greet people is really interesting to me because people get annoyed with me because I could be like dancing a jig, having a good time, and then they're like, how are you? And I'd be like, fine. And I think that's really interesting that I do that, not knowing that's how Swedes do. So now we have, nah, ganska bra faktiskt. Shane, hey, hur är det? Nej, ganska bra faktiskt. Very good. So Diane, hey, hur är det? Impossible. I can't hear anything that I'm familiar with. It is literally a foreign language. You might as well be speaking Martian. Rebecca, hey, hur är det? Hold on. <laughs> Hold on. Yeah. Okay. To me, the Swedish language, do not hate me, but it kind of sounds like gibberish, like, you know, it's like, I can't, my mouth can't form it. Hey, who did it? Okay, I'm, I'm sorry, what? <laughs> Every word in English is pronounced, and you run the, the sentence together. Ganska bra. Fuck it. Oh, that's not nice. Matthew? Yeah. Hey, hur är det? Nah, ganska bra faktiskt. Damn, that was good! Oh. <laughs> I don't want you to leave here today without some useful phrases in Swedish. So, Eric, can you pass this around? Let's start with a... Vi sitter väl ute? Vi sitter väl ute? Vi sitter väl ute? Yeah, good, thank you. Ska vi gå in? Yeah. Meaning, should we move inside? We're not stupid. How would it look if all of you did so? How would it look? How would it look? Mike, how are you doing? I'm uh, good. <laughs> this doesn't make sense. How would it look? So, Rebecca, how was the Swedish lesson? Got it. Okay. Gangsta brothackus. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Is that good? Yeah, you have to work on it a little bit. Little bit. Yeah, like, you got that idea. Okay. It's all there. Thank you very much. Thank Great. You. Great. Go ahead, practice. <laughs> Bye. 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 We need to, to get some <laughs> serious butt kicking going on because yeah, we we're making it to the end yes, we are. of this adventure. My expectations for tomorrow are just like, who knows what's going to happen. Again, I know this is a competition, so I'm going to show up with my game face just in case I have to use it. <laughs> Come on. Are we making an alliance? We're making an alliance. <gasps> 
shit just got real. Yeah! yeah! <laughs> I haven't felt a, a push for competition, but we've all talked that definitely it's coming. And so, no, I don't think anyone's totally unaware. Ni har väl gjort backup på era hårddiskar hemma. Tänk att ni har sparat där. Håller hårddisken mer än 6-7 år får man vara glad. Sen är det borta. Tjoff, sådär. Där får man se att utvecklingen verkligen gått bakåt om man jämför med runstenar. De håller jäkligt länge. De äldsta är från 300-talet, de flesta från 1100-talet. Däremot så innehåller de ju väldigt lite information. Igul Björn reste stenen efter sin pappa Frey. Hej! Och så sen som ett tvåtons sms från ett årtusende till ett annat. Eller gåtfulla som rökstenen i Östergötland som ingen riktigt ännu lyckats tyda. I allt för Sveriges första lagtävling ska deltagarna nu tyda runor som ska leda dem rätt i sökandet efter sitt förflutna. I'm red because I don't I'm look red. any good in yellow. Okay, yellow team. Michael, Eric, Laura, Don, Lori. All right, that's a sign. Yay! Red team, John, Shane, Matthew, Diane, Rebecca. All right, team yellow! Texas! To hell with you. Come on, Texas. We're going to win. When I saw Diane's name on the red team, I was like, oh, we're done. They're going down. Yeah. Yes, they're going Damn. down. Diane's amazing, don't get me wrong, in her own little way. But when I saw these three guys, I'm like, no, no one's going to beat us. Red is power. This just reminded us that it's not yeah, summer so camp anymore. Right. Right. This people is... are going to go home. Yeah. yeah. Well, physical activity is not my area of expertise. Uh, I have misgivings. We'll see. Time will tell. All right, but the only option is to win. Right. Yeah, no, okay. I would, we can all agree on that. Failure <laughs> yeah. is not an option. Uh, I think we got the team that's going to win. This is it. So they might as well go ahead and give us the prize or whatever they're going to give us on this one. So uh, it's a done deal. All right, team ready, Red everybody? is the winning We're gonna team. We're going to go Team Red. One, team two, three. Red! red. I see a bad moon rising for the other team. <laughs> All right, so it's time for Alt for Sveriges first team challenge. One team will win, one will lose. The losing team will then have to meet in an individual challenge where it is decided who is going to be the first to leave the show. That's the bad news. The good news is that's not until next week. Nobody leaves the show without getting a chance to learn more about his or her Swedish past. Here in the soils around Sigtuna, archaeologists have found many interesting things, treasures even. And so will you. Today, you are going to dig for your past. Okay, let's get started. Tävlingen går ut på att deltagarna ska tyda runskriften på skyltarna på marken och hitta sina efternamn. På den stora runstenen har de ett alfabet i runskrift till sin hjälp. När alla lagmedlemmar har hittat sin namnskylt får laget börja gräva. Nere i jorden kommer varje deltagare att kunna finna en bild ur sin släkts förflutna. När bilden är uppgrävd ska den sättas upp på lagets tavla och det lag som först fått alla bilder på plats vinner. Okej, så vi bara hittar den första letter. Memorize what letters we need. M. M. B. A. P. F. And um, whoever is done first immediately start helping the next person that's not done okay this is going to be within seconds right. mm -hmm. so run running yes. digging with all your might right. we're here digging for the past literally we're trying to figure out through the land of sweden who our family was so i think that it's it's an interesting metaphor and, and, and when i heard that man this switch flipped in me and i was like oh we're winning this <laughs> and last but not least keep cool Keep oh, cool, yeah, guys. Yeah, We've right. got this. Yeah, Let's go dig some treasure. Yeah. Okej, 
Okej. Okay. Are you ready? Yes sir. Yes. Let's do it. Klara, färdiga, gå. So, congratulations, Red Team. Now you're safe for another week. I was really excited that I get to stay here another week and see what else is out there. So, one more week is such a blessing. Uh, any idea what you found? I still can't. Pictures. Yeah. <laughs> so what do you say? Why don't you go help the Yellow Team find their treasures too? Yeah, go help them. I feel like we did an amazing job. We just really worked well as a team, and it, what we said we were going to do, we did, and it, it worked really well. All right. It sucks to be on the losing team. Good job, guys. Good job. Woo! I thought we had the stronger team. I am a little dejected now, realizing that I don't have this in the bag, and so I'm going to really have to fight to stay here. That was intense and to lose. It was totally intense. This is very important to me. It's a part of my heritage that I'm coming to know, and uh, I have to say. This is a good prize, though, I have oh, to say. Yeah. Yeah. I, I have won. Nice. I hope they let me keep this. Okay. We all got to dig up something. It wasn't just a box of rocks, but it actually was a box of family history. Oh, oh. They say stuff on the back. Oh, they do? Yeah. Oh, oh you've got people. Yeah. Yeah. Holy cow. Wow, it's on he just says it's connected. It. To, to see that picture, it just, uh, my, my heart just went through the roof. I mean, it just like put me on cloud nine. Can you guys tore it up? Good job. I'm looking at this picture and I'm like, wow. And I'm just in this complete daze. I, I didn't care what else was going on. I, I was so thrilled. My great, great, great grandmother and her daughters, they left Sweden and moved to Chicago. 123 years ago. And now finally, you know, I was able to come back. It feels absolutely amazing to be here and I can't wait to see more of it. It's yeah. amazing. You know, right? I mean, we get to meet somebody at the airport that we were related to. Now we get, we get pic actual pictures it's, of It's happened quickly, yeah. you know? Yeah, it is. That man does yeah. look like you. You think? <laughs> it's awesome, though. So I don't know who this is, but 
finding this in the dirt and digging for my pass today is really the kickoff for me of what this entire experience is all about, and we're gonna do it together. Welcome home. 